Hi, I'm Michael Roth, and today we're going to be doing a basic staining procedure. You're going to need everything you see right here, including a microscope slide, something to rinse into, some stain, and some DI water. One safety note, remember that stain stains, so keep it off of your hands and keep it off of your clothes. The first thing you're going to need to do is take your microscope slide and place your sample approximately in the center of the microscope slide. Whatever your sample may be, take a small piece and put it right in the middle. Your next step is to take your stain and you're going to put a small drop of stain so that it covers your sample. You don't need very much stain, just enough to cover it. So keep your drops small so that you save stain for the other groups. Most stains need to sit for about a minute, but check with your particular procedure to see how long your stain sits. This particular stain needs a minute, so once a minute is up, it's time to rinse. Don't rinse your stain into the sink, you need to be rinsing it into a collection vessel so that your teacher can dispose of it later. When you're rinsing off, use your deionized water and you're spraying above the sample. Don't spray directly on your sample or you might wash it off of your slide entirely and then you'll have to start over. So spray above and let it run down the slide to rinse it off. Once it's all gone, that's all there is to it. That's the basic staining procedure. There will be some particulars for your stain. You may have to do it more than once. You may have to do it a little longer or not quite as long, but that's the basic idea. Good luck.